Today's video is going to be all about a fall shop with me slash a fall decor haul. So over the past couple weeks I've accumulated tons of different fall home decor and I'm really excited to show you all of what I got. Um, I also did shoot some footage when I went to Hobby Lobby of some of the stuff that they have in store and just kind of give you like a nice fall vibe. Um, I didn't film everywhere I went to because that would have been a lot of footage <laughs> and um, I went throughout multiple weeks. So just when they started bringing stuff out, I anticipate that they're going to start bringing more and more stuff out. So I'll probably still add to it. I shouldn't, but I probably will. <laughs> but I will show you the things that I have for it right now and all the different places you should check out that you may not have thought of or um, other kind of the new things that are on the horizon. So this is going to be the shop with me and the decor haul. And then my next video is going to be the decorate with me. So I'm going to decorate for fall um, probably next weekend. <laughs> and uh, you guys will see that the following Monday. And that video is just going to show you all the items that I use from this haul and kind of where I put them in our home as well as the stuff that I've accumulated over the past couple of years. So I'm really excited to film that video for you guys too. I love watching Decorate With Me's and I think it's going to be so fun. I'm so excited for the fall if you can't tell. And I realize I'm wearing a black bra through this and you can totally see my bra strap because I'm a classy broad. But I'm just really excited for Halloween I suppose. Um, just ignore that please. I didn't think about that when I put the shirt on this morning. So, or just to film, you know, I wanted it to be fall and festive. So, um, we are now in my living room. We're in front of my fireplace and you can see all, I meant to fix this too. I'm so professional. Anyway, the garland is from Target, by the way, and it's, um, I got it when it first came out. It came out during the summertime, um, but I have seen it now on clearance because it is summer stuff. So if you like it, check your Target to see if they have it. I'm pretty sure you can find it online as well. Pop right in to the fall haul. The first things first is pillows. Now, this isn't super exciting, I know, but I feel like you need some pillows to amp up things. Pillows are great. And a lot of times, you just need some basic colors. And that's what I was looking for. I actually wanted more of a like Halloween orange, and I thought that's what I ordered. I don't know how I got this one, but I like it, and I think it'll be good for at least all the fall, I and mean, I feel like I can still make it work for Halloween. But it's this basically really plush, rust-colored pillow. These are from Walmart, and I want to say I got a set of these for $9, maybe a little less. I got two pillows. Um, this is from the Mainstays line. If I can find everything online, I will try to link what I found below, so you guys can just go to the and shop the links. Um, but I really like these. I feel like pillows are hit or miss when you order online, which I did for these, um, because you don't really know how fluffy and plush they are. And since these were super, super cheap, I didn't expect much from them, but all the reviews said that they were really good. So I was like, let's just go for it. It's not that big of a deal. I can return it if I need to. And I'm so pleasantly surprised. Like, look how thick that is. It's a nice pillow for the price. So I do believe these came in a couple of other colors. If you're interested and you just want new basic pillows, um, these are pretty nice. I mean, I think they'll be perfect for the fall and I like them. I like them. So we have these. And then something else I ordered off of Walmart's website, but they don't sell from, they're not like from Walmart, um, but Walmart does a lot of different like stores, kind of like Amazon in a way, like they have a lot of different companies that use them as well. And um, I got these, which are pillow covers, and they're this really pretty, um, what do we want to, like, buffalo check, is that buffalo check? Plaid print fabric? You know, it just screams fall to me, like it's fall harvest, it's kind of like the gingham shirt that I had in my Route 21 haul, it's just so exciting to me. These are super nice too. I want to say I paid under 20 for two of these. Um, the only thing is these don't come with the inserts, but I do have inserts that will fit this size. But these are really nice. They're not super scratchy, which you can never know um, getting this type of fabric. It's nice. I think it's pretty, and it just makes me excited. I think this will look good for Halloween. I think this will look good for the fall. I was trying to go with more of like a bright orange, but now that I'm placing them two together next to my shirt, I'm kind of glad I didn't. But we'll see. I think I think we can make it work, right? You think you can make that work? I think we can make it work. But I really like these. <laughs> next. 
Another thing from Walmart was this pillow. Now this pillow was super inexpensive. It was $5.44 and you can tell that just by the quality <laughs> that it definitely is a bit cheaper. You can see how plush this one is and how thin this one is. This one isn't as nice, but it's cute. We're not gonna use this as to like lay our heads on or anything like that. I probably would just put it over in my armchair right over there. Um, I need something to kind of just pop against that. I think this will look really pretty there. It just says hello fall. It's kind of like these um kind of like almost felt lettering, but it's not. It's nice, it's cute. It's nothing like super crazy great, but it's nice without spending a lot of money because holiday pillows can be super pricey. Like I said before, I think like at Target and stuff when they bring out the Christmas pillows, although they are super adorable, they're like $20 each at least. And so I can just get really expensive. So I just like cute little pillow. I'm going to just throw it on my chair and call it a day. I like it. It's not bad. So, and then look, look how cute it looks. So perfectly fall. So perfectly fall. All right. Now, I'm the, I feel like an old lady because I like hand towels <laughs> that are decorative. I think I got that from my mom. They have so many hand towels and they're all like seasonal. Like we don't have anything that is just like kitchen, you know, like it's just meant to be like a year round thing or a color. They're all like 4th of July, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Halloween, like, and I get that from her, I guess. So Walmart had super cheap. Both of these towels were 88 cents. So I'm super excited. They're so cute. They're so cute for the kitchen. This one just says give thanks. I just thought that was so cute. How cute is that? For 88 cents, that was a steal. And then this one just says happy fall. Also super cute. They're just happy and they're festive without having to like go crazy in your kitchen if you don't want to buy kitchen decor or like cookie jars and stuff like that. You just want something to spice up the kitchen a tiny bit. Like throw in a cute kitchen towel. Or in the bathroom. Like how cute and so cheap. Telling you, don't knock Walmart till you try it. I know that a lot of people don't think Walmart's the best place for decor, and there's a lot of things that aren't great for decor at Walmart, but there's a lot of things that are. So you just kind of have to look around without breaking the bank. You can really go and decorate and pizzazz up the place. All right, moving on. So in this haul, I'm gonna show you some just fall things, sort of Thanksgiving-y too, like you can keep them up all fall um, and use them for Thanksgiving. And I'm also gonna show you some Halloween decor as well. I don't have a whole lot of Halloween decor. I think I just have always kept up my fall stuff and just made it into Halloween just because I've had so many pumpkins. But this year I really wanted to have some actual like like Halloween decor. So I'm really excited with the stuff that I did get and I will show you that as well. I'll probably lump everything into the Halloween section and everything into the fall section. All right, so in the video of me shopping, you'll see that I went to Hobby Lobby, and I love to go to Hobby Lobby for fall Christmas decor, decor in general, but it's so fun to go for the seasons. Now, I was a little disappointed this year, and I don't know if that's just because I have already tons and tons and tons of pumpkins, so I wasn't looking for pumpkin decor, but I normally really love their signage that they have, and I just was kind of disappointed this year. But I still got a couple things. I still think it's worth it, especially if you don't have a whole lot of fall stuff. I think Hobby Lobby is a great place to start because they're reasonably priced. They normally always have like 40% to 50% off. Um, it's like every other week they kind of switch back and forth. So I think it really is worth it to check it out. But I just was kind of disappointed this year. I feel like they kind of like wasn't as good. The first thing I'll show you is this sign that says give thanks. Now I know a lot of people think of fall and they think of like oranges and reds and browns, kind of like what I already showed you before, but if your like style doesn't necessarily go with that or your house you're worried about it kind of like clashing with a lot of your stuff, I know that the farm you know house is really in if you have like a lot of white but you still want things to look pretty and fall and kind of rustic. This is a great option for you. They have a lot of that stuff now um, where it's not just bright orange in your house. You can do a lot of whites and browns that are really clean and crisp, but they still give you that feel. So this one just says give thanks. It's super cute. Comes on this little burlap string. It's nice and lightweight. I don't know where I'm gonna put this yet. Honestly, most of my stuff isn't farmhouse. <laughs> it's more modern. But I still think this is really cute, and I'll find some place to put it. Um, this was only $6.99 full price, and then it, we, that week we, it was 40% off as well. So definitely worth it. I thought this was really, really great for the price. It's cute, 
pretty. I like it. The next thing I got is another sign from Hobby Lobby, and I didn't realize until I actually got up to the checkout that everything I said, or everything I got, pretty much said give thanks on it, but that's okay. We're just gonna roll with it. This one says, in all things, give thanks. So, as you can tell, this is the complete opposite kind of design as this one. Although they can still go together because they still have like that wood little planking. But as you can tell, this is more um, traditional like fall. And we have the more clean, modern-y farmhouse type of style. Um, but I really like this one. I thought this was so pretty. I think this is, I'm going to place it against my mantle with all of my pumpkins. And I think it's going to look so nice. Um, I really liked this one. I thought it was really nice for the price. They have kind of like some sparkly glitter on it on some of the leaves as accents. I don't know if you can see any of that. Um, but it says in all things give thanks. And I just, I really liked it. I thought this is really pretty as well. And it's not obnoxiously fall. You know, sometimes things just get a little too orange. <laughs> Um, this was $13.99, and you can hang it also on the wall. Um, I, like I said, I'm going to lean it up against my mantle area, but this was also 40% off. Um, if you are going to go to Hobby Lobby, I would definitely check either your ad or go on the website and see what's on sale. Like I said, they, I feel like they flop every other week. So one week it'll be like all the seasonal decor is 40%, 50% off, and the other week it'll be like... They're regular home decor. So if you're looking specifically for seasonal decor, make sure you search that week to make sure that you're having the sale. Otherwise, I would just wait a week and go that next weekend because it's not worth it to miss out on it. Although if you do go and it's not on sale online or through their app, they have a 40% coupon code um, that you can use on any full priced item. So that should help you out too. Sorry, you can hear Ollie. <laughs> She's in her room playing. Um, the next to last item that I got, no, this is the last item that I got from Hobby Lobby. Um, and I got a pumpkin. Now, like I said, I already have tons and tons of pumpkins. But I like to add a new one at least every year. And I just thought this was so pretty. It just, like I said, this is perfect if you have more of a crisp, clean style and you don't want to throw a lot of really bright fall colors or you just want to go more white and gold or white and silver this is a perfect option for you i just mix everything i don't care but this one just says grateful and i love the word grateful i like it a lot because what i think when we think of thanksgiving it's always thanks and i think thankful and being thankful it's a wonderful thing but i feel like grateful to me is like a step above being thankful. I don't know why, I just feel like that's how it is. So I just really love that this one said grateful. They did have one that said thankful and they did have one that said blessed. Um, all in this size. I want to say they had bigger ones too, but I know that they definitely just had them in this, this size. I think it's so pretty and so clean. I think this would look so nice in just like in a bedroom or on the fireplace mantle or in a bathroom, something that's like in a kitchen. Something where you want to add a tiny bit of like decor, but you don't want to go over the top. Um, this was $5.99, which I thought was a wonderful price, and 40% off on top of that. So, really great. I really, really like them. I think getting the trio of them would all be really nice too. Like the grateful, thankful, and blessed would be really nice. This is the last thing I got from Hobby Lobby, <laughs> and this is Christmas. They have all the Christmas stuff out, and when I went last time, all their Christmas stuff was also discounted along with their fall decor. So if you're looking for Christmas things or want to get like a jump start on your Christmas decor, I'd check it out. I like this. I love the buffalo check print. Our whole Christmas bedding is in that. I just think it's so cute. It says good tidings of comfort and joy. I just really loved it. This was $7.99. Um, I feel like it was a little pricey for what it was, but it's still cute, and I got it for 40% off, so I don't mind, but I really did like it. Okay. The next place that I went to was Kirkland's. Now, I'd never been to Kirkland's before, but my parents are redoing their one of their bathrooms at their house, and they were looking for a mirror, um, and they were told Kirkland's was a great place to look, so I went on with them to help them kind of decide, and I stumbled upon the mecca of cute fall things, and Thanksgiving things, and Halloween things. I can't wait to see what they bring out for Christmas so many cute things and were pretty reasonably priced as well um so i will show you i only got two things from there i plan on kind of going back and kind of see if i missed anything but i didn't really like a lot of the stuff they had so this is the first thing i really love these like little shadow boxes one because i think they're great i just think they're cute and they add a bit more um kind of like texture and a uh, height um and width to like a gallery wall 
but they're really easy to hang those are super light and they're so wide so you can just it's a lot easier to hang and they stand up well on like a mantle or a shelf or something like that so i like that they're very versatile um this one says hello fall which i just think was so cute i just fall okay everything says hello fall but i just thought it was sweet i liked the pumpkin once again it's kind of more of the traditional fall decor but i really liked it and I believe that these were 20% off when I bought them, so. And the last thing I got from Kirkland's was this cute mason jar little sign as well. And this one, little plaque I guess, this one says let's fall in love. Which I thought was cute because it's still fall related but it's not like hello fall, which I have 50 things of apparently. So I just thought this was still cute. Um, it's pretty big and pretty heavy actually. I, you have, it does have like the little hanging anchor thing jigger but um i don't know if i'm gonna hang this on the wall or if i'm gonna put it on the mantle it is pretty heavy so um but i just thought that was sweet i liked it i thought it was cute but for 7.99 i i did think this was pretty good um okay moving on to target so far i've only gotten one thing from target they don't have a lot of their fall stuff out yet or their halloween stuff at least not yet i think all of that comes out in september um when all of the back to school stuff is like completely pretty much all gone and then they move in all their halloween and fall stuff um our targets are com being completely remodeled and changed if yours are too let me know how you feel about them they're really fancy they look cool but it's just not the same like i don't get that warmth that i used to get when i shop at target they've like done away with so much of the red it's just really gray and white which i normally love those colors but i don't know it's just too much i feel like everything doesn't flow as well as it used to be. I'm kind of disappointed. Like I used to love to go shopping at Target and now I just feel kind of overwhelmed and I don't like it anymore. So we have two Targets in my city. We have a Super Target and a regular just Target. The Super Target is being remodeled. It's almost done. The regular Target, I don't know if it is going to be remodeled. I'm really hoping it's not because I probably will just continue shopping there unless I really need something from Super Target. But um, I hope it's not been remodeled. But if it has been remodeled in your area, do you like it, the new remodeling? If you are a big Target lover, is it something that you like? It's really nice. I think the grocery area is really pretty. I do like that, but I just don't like anything else. It just makes me kind of sad. I don't like how they remodeled everything. <laughs> anyway, I digress. That's, this is not what this video is about. The only thing I got was from their dollar section. They had like two things up, um, and I pretty much think I got the one of the only things that was actually worth it um so far they didn't have very many things up but i have seen on instagram and stuff people have been picking up some really cute things from the dollar section so i'm excited to go check it out this one just says harvest this is another really good option if you like more of that clean modern feel but you still want to sort of decorate um this was three dollars now from far away i think it looks like pretty nice um and when it's hung on the wall or it's one of those thicker things that you can just kind of you know a plaque again like you can just kind of or shadow box and you know what I'm saying stand it up um, but when you actually hold it it's really cheap <laughs> you can tell how cheap it is but from all like on the wall and so from far away I don't think you can it looks a little bit more expensive than it was um, but I just thought it was really cute it just says harvest I do believe they had one that said fall but all of the ones that said fall I think there's only other one other one it was like ripped up so I got a harvest one, but I like it. I don't have a lot of harvest things, so I think it's good that I got harvest rather than fall. Now moving on to the Halloween stuff. I'm probably more excited for the Halloween things than I am for the fall things, mostly because I don't have a whole lot of Halloween items, and I'm just excited for Halloween this year. I don't know why. I don't know. It's just because I have two kids this year, or I don't, I don't know. I'm just I'm pretty pumped for Halloween. I don't know what they're being yet. Ollie's fixated on being Sky from Paw Patrol, but then she goes back to Elsa, and I'm like, every kid wants to be Elsa. Every kid. Let's try something else, you know? Something else, please. Anyway, so I'm going to show you the stuff that I got all for Halloween. The majority of the stuff did come from Home Goods. Home Goods is great. And if you have one in your area, definitely check it out. But if you don't, I have realized that TJ Maxx now offers um, the Home Goods a lot of their stuff online they didn't used to it used to just be kind of whatever they could get in the area that's what you got in your home goods but it cut or tj maxx too and they would just kind of differ around the whole 
country I suppose but now they do offer some stock online so I think that there's at least one of these things that you can order online um, I'll try to find the rest of them for you if you're interested but I think that's really awesome if you don't have a home goods in your area I know I've seen a lot of on a lot of youtubers and a lot of people in the comments on other videos would say oh I don't have a home goods near me so that's a good option and I don't know if they ship internationally internationally but if they do um, that's an awesome op as well. So the first thing I got is more towels. <laughs> so I have some fall towels and now I have some Halloween towels. I just thought these were so cute. They're like a little puppy, um, like a little hipster puppy with a cute little jack o sweatered on and it comes in a set of two and the other side was a nice little one that just has tons of jack o lanterns on. These are definitely a lot nicer than the 88 cents ones from Walmart but I'm not super picky about towels. Um, but these are pretty thick. I obviously haven't tested their, you know, actual towel abilities but I do really like them I think they're really pretty um, and these were $6.99 for a set of two so I thought these were cute they were by Hallow's Eve and I think they had different options I think they have a cat one if you don't like the dog next thing is another sign because I can't stop I don't think I have any signs though that are for Halloween and I probably will end up getting a couple more just because like I said I don't have a whole lot um, but I just thought this was super cute. I love little witch's hat. It just says happy Halloween. They did have, I think, one or two more. One was like trick or treat. And I'm pretty sure they had another type. But I just like the witch's hat. I love the simple simplicity of it. I love the frame and the color of it. I thought it was really pretty. This is another option if you don't want to go super fall, but it still has those warm tones in it. And this was only $7.99. So definitely worth the price. It's nice. It's cute. I think this will look cute on the mantle as well. The next thing is something that I know you can buy online because I saw it online. I wanted something really cute to hang, like another garland. I love garlands. I think they add so much. I have a whole bunch of fall leaves that light up, so that'll be perfect for the fall. But for Halloween, I didn't want to leave the leaves up. I feel like you get kind of leaved out. So I was ready to switch to something a little bit more festive, and I found this. So this is a set of like those wool garlands, wool ball garlands that are really in right now. I like this because it looks... A lot more expensive than it was a lot of times when you want like specialty items like this and go on Etsy it's super pricey like upwards of 50 really really pricey um, and this was only $12.99 so I was super excited about it it's really nice quality I love the wool balls they're just black and orange I think it'll look so cute and it's not overly whelming of like Halloween but it's still you definitely get the point across but um, I know that they saw this online because it was something that I saw online before I actually went to home goods and I was gonna order it and then I found it in store so I will try and leave that link below if you really like it and you want a fun garland I feel like though this year is gonna be pretty popular Halloween garlands or I feel like normally they're not I feel like I keep seeing a lot of different Halloween garlands out all right all right I think we just have two more items and then we are done so this next thing okay so this is the last item from home goods and then I have one more item that is from Walmart but it was Halloween themed so I didn't want to throw it in with the fall stuff and I'm a lover of mugs and pugs. <laughs> I have a pug named Frank, and so I found this pug mug, and it's Halloween, it's so cute. I don't think I have a Halloween mug. I think I might have had one in college and it broke. Um, so I was so excited to see a cute Halloween one. I need something for fall. I feel like I have fall mugs too. I have collected so many mugs, collected so many mugs over my little lifetime so far, and I don't know where half of them are. When I got married, I'm sure my husband just threw one of the boxes away because he was tired of like us taking so much room. Anyway, um, but I just think this is so cute. It's a little pug. And the inside says pumpkin pug with a pumpkin. It's just so cute. I love it. If you don't like pugs, I don't know who you are, but I love pugs. Um, and they do have a kitten one, and I think they have another dog, at least another dog. So, you know, if you just want to, if you like, if you like them, you know. I just think it's cute. It has little bats and paw prints on the inside. I'm just, it's super cute. Anyway, it was $4.99, super cheap. I like the size. It's a nice, like, mm, cozy mug size. I love coffee in the morning. I love my green tea lattes. Green tea, green, green tea latte. There we go. There we go. <laughs> All right. All right. Moving on to the last item. So, this is 
our last item and I really like it. I'm really excited. I feel like these are pretty popular now. They're pretty easy to get your hands on. Um, but I just thought this was so pretty. I probably would get something like this if it was like Christmas or something like that. But for Halloween, it just it gets me excited and pumped. It is a novelty light up set that says the word boo. I just think it's so cute. They light up. Um, I don't have batteries in it yet, so I can't light it up for you. But you will see in the um, decorate with me. So keep tuned if you want to see that. But it was originally $19.84 and I got this for $10. So definitely worth it. Was it $10? Yeah, I think it was $10. But it's heavy. Like these aren't cheap little letters. I thought they were going to be a little bit more like maybe cardboard, a little cheapy. No, like these are like metal letters and it's heavy. So super cute. Order this online. Don't know if they have it in store, but I will leave a link to you guys if you can want to order it online they still have it but it's sparkly black and orange I just it's so exciting it's so Halloween to me I think it's so cute it looks so cute on the mantle uh oh I mean look at that together how cute is that it's so cute I'm so excited all right that is the end of this video I have a huge mess around me to clean up now but I hope you guys enjoyed it I can't wait to film the decorate with me next week I'm just ready to say goodbye to summer and hello to fall fall is my favorite time of the year because that gets me super pumped for all of the fun activities and holidays that are around the corner so I'm so excited I hope you guys enjoyed this video I'm so excited for all the new subscribers I've gotten I know it's barely anything compared to so many other channels but it makes me so happy that there are some of you that enjoy watching my videos because I have so much fun filming them and I really hope that comes off to you guys so Stay tuned for a fall decorate with me, and then afterwards, we're gonna do another plus size clothing haul. And I think that's it. I think that is it. So, welcome to all my new subscribers. Thank you so much for stopping by this channel. I hope you enjoyed this video. I can't wait to see you guys again soon. I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.